Hello everyone, this is Shrine Morning, and today I'm playing Undertale. Long ago, two races ruled over the Earth, humans and monsters. One day, war broke out between the two races. After a long battle, the humans were victorious. They sealed the monsters underground with a magic spell. Many years later, Mount Ebbet. Twenty... something, we don't know. Fifteen? Sixteen? Legends say that those who climb the mountain never return. So naturally that's where we decide to go. This could not possibly go wrong. Alright, or, or maybe it did, just a little bit. Well, that's a shame. Oh, hey. We got columns of some sort. That's an interesting little intro. Oh, Undertale. Press 2 or enter. Or since I'm using the Xbox 360 controller, I'll have to figure it out for myself. There we go. So the controls seem pretty simple. There's only one, two, three, four, five, six things mentioned there, and one's just a general guideline saying when HP is zero, you lose. And that's pretty basic stuff. So, even though this doesn't really tell me what the controls are for the joystick, does that help? That doesn't really help too much. But anyway, let's begin. I have to name myself. So Undertale's a game which has received quite a bit of praise so far. I've heard quite a few things about it, and I decided to give it a shot to see how it is, because I figured it'd be interesting. Now, I don't know too much about this game, but I do know that there are different endings, and you can achieve them through either killing everything or or not killing everything. And maybe there's more endings than just that, but that's what I'm aware of so far. And other than that, I don't know too much about it. So we'll take our little character here, who looks like a Simpson reject, and just go through the door. And there's a flower. Oh, it's Flowey. Flowey the flower. Nice to meet you. Oh yeah, I suppose I'm new to this. It's the first time playing. Well, not really. It seems like a basic RPG so far, even though we haven't gotten any combat yet. Although, now that I mention that, we're probably gonna have something coming up right now. And I'm supposing you're gonna be the one to teach me about that stuff, aren't you? Hmm. Sure. Whatever you say. Oh, that hurts my soul. But in that case, what would be my heart? Well, whatever. You can grow strong if you gain a lot of LV experience points, I'm guessing, so... And I can move around too. That's good to know. Love, of course. Sure, whatever you say. Um... I don't know, if it's gonna be that kind of game, I guess so. Will you? It's shared through... little white friendliness pellets. Really, is that what you call them? Move around, get as many as I can. Or I'll try to avoid them all, actually. Yeah, I kinda did. I'm not sure, buddy pal. Oops. Well, how do we do that again? Wait, bullets? Um... Hmm... Yeah, you're kind of a creeper, aren't you? Well, no, I didn't want to see you suffer, I just didn't want to suffer myself. Oh. Well then. Um. Oh. You've been saved. Yeah, burn, flower, burn. Um. Are you some kind of goat thing? Yeah, thanks for saving me though, I guess. I guess I should be thankful. Caretaker of the Ruins. Alright. So you control this place down here. 
Well, we fell. How long exactly? Alright, I'll let you guide me. So, I guess we'll follow Goat Lady for now. See what she has to show us. Ooh, what's this? Sparkly. Unfilled determination. Okay, so it's a safe point. Cool. Three minutes in so far. I don't suppose I could have read that sign, but whatever. Oh, it's a puzzle. Simple enough. Well, it'll probably get harder later on, I'm assuming. So, uh, I guess I don't have to do that myself. Huh. Alright. Well, that makes things much easier for me. Press Z to read signs, oh, or B for me, and what a useful sign that was considering I had to read it to find out what it said. Stay on the path. Okay, thank you. Incredibly useful sign. Well, is this the one marked off? Oh, there we go. What happens if I press the wrong one? Well, I suppose I have to decide, am I going to be doing things the good route or the bad route? I suppose we'll start off doing it the good way. <sighs> Splendid. I'm proud of you, little one. Thank you, I've done such a tremendous job flipping that one switch. It's like Portal or something. Is that a monster right there? It kind of looks like a dummy. Maybe it is a dummy. Mm-hmm. So yeah, we can strike up conversations. I guess that's how you're supposed to end things peacefully in these fights. Oh, okay, so that's how it works. That's interesting. So in the fights, we just have to stall for time, and then she's gonna be the one that rescues us. I guess as an alternate, we could fight the monsters, but I think that leads to the bad ending, at least from what I've heard. Sure. Alright, we encountered the dummy, now what? I guess it's called Mercy? Spare or flay? Hmm. What does Act do? Check? Alright, so that tells us the stats. You're the apple of my eye, what does that have to do with anything? And the dummy does nothing, because it's it's just a dummy. I guess you're supposed to talk to it. You talk to the dummy, don't we feel like a dummy after that? Oh, alright, we did it. We got nothing from it though. Very good, we're very, very good, yes. Probably. Did it talk to you? Let's see. Is there anything behind here? Alright, so that lets us go to the menu. Is it not in this section of the room? Oh, it's a fight. Alright, so I guess we have to... We could compliment the frog. Aw, that's a cute little frog. What does it say if you check it? Life is difficult for this enemy. Oh, she's watching us. <laughs> that was a little awkward. <laughs> Alright then, I, I guess that accomplishes it. The western room is the eastern room's blueprint. Ah, oh, alright, so... I guess we have to follow this pattern? Maybe? I'm guessing there's some significance to that. I don't know how I'm supposed to count them off, though. I guess with steps, let's say. So I go about one, two... It's like two seconds of walking up a little... Alright, I'll just have to do as best as I can. Whatever. There are random fights, so I shouldn't walk around too much, I guess. Oh, it's for this.
Oh, she's just gonna do it for us, I guess. Oh, all right. That makes things easier. Not to seem unappreciative or anything, Goat Mom, but I do kind of want to play the game myself and, you know, figure out the puzzles. Sure, if you say so. And what's that? Walk to the end by myself. Alright. Something's supposed to happen. This is gonna be a never ending hallway. There's probably something on the wall we're supposed to have checked. Oh. She's back there. Okay. Well, I did notice. And that is? Oh, well, it's no problem. I mean, I can handle myself. Believe it or not, I have done this kind of thing before. A cell phone. Well, all right, that makes things a bit easier then. Can you get cell phones? Can I actually access it now? Say hello about yourself. Call her mom. Flirt? Flirt? That's a bit awkward. Oh, uh, just talk about herself, I guess. Oh, about her, I guess, rather. Okay. We could try the other options, I guess. Hey, what's up, Toriel? Uh, we did leave that one room. Hey, little froggy. This is the same one that we, uh, let go before. Really? So you can also kind of, like, battle them in submission. Like, if you damage them enough, they won't want to fight you. That's interesting. So mercy is for sparing them after they're in submission mode. Okay. Got it. Oh, we have another froggit. I guess we have to do it ourselves this time. Uh, we'll compliment this one. He was flattered anyway. Blushes deeply. Oh, he's sending flies at us. Oh no. One came from off screen and got me. So can you just give him mercy? There we go. Oh, we got money from it. That's good. There we go. And that restores our HP anyway. So that's convenient. What's this? Oh no, we fell. Where are we now? Oh, it goes... Oh, okay, so we can... Alright, well, now we know. Oh, hey, calling again. Cinnamon or butterscotch? Uh... I don't know. I guess I'd pick cinnamon out of the two. No problem. Oh my goodness, she's going to call us every five seconds, isn't she? I'm not sure we answered that time, but I, I probably wouldn't mind too much. Three out of four gray rocks recommend that you push them. Okay, so... I, oops. Oh, it's a different enemy. Console it. Oh, well, that makes things easier. <laughs> and that did what? I guess it prevented a trap from going off. Um, 
Was there a pattern in another room that I didn't see? There probably was. Oh wait, here we go. Oh man, I'm never gonna remember this. So down all the way, and then we go over about one. There's two spots. All right, I, I kind of got this, I think. Oh, we got two of them now? Oh man. Well, the one thing will retreat right away, so we'll do that, I guess. All right. Uh oh. Yeah, I hear frog. Wow. It doesn't know why it's here. All right. It's all right, froggy. We don't need to fight. <laughs> well, I can't even get us if it tries, really. All right, get out of here. Yeah, I do like the combat in this game. It is different from pretty much everything else that I've seen anyway. So it's pretty cool. You just go down this way, right? Go over, and then up, and then over, and then down. Oh, how far over do you have to go now? Oh, so close. Oh, you have to be all the way to the right, okay. What was it, three out of four rocks? I wonder if there's one that I can't push here. Oh, don't fight it. I'm not even sure if uh, fighting it even really has a point because flirt with it. I don't know, let's just check it out first. Because so far just sparing things seems much easier. Trivaciously attractive, but no brains. I guess we just don't level up the sexy wiggle. I guess we have to flirt with it then. Whoa, all right, it has, um. That was close, it just kind of ended right before I got hit. Alright, so... How's it going, you sexy little blob, you? Well then. Okay. That was close, almost got hit again. Do we flirt again or spare it? I'm not sure how we're supposed to know. Spare shows up as yellow. I wonder if that's the key. Check in the beginning of the fight then. Whoa there, partner. Ah, yeah, there we go. <laughs> I had a feeling that would happen. All right. Yeah, just a little bit more, maybe. No, that's not the way I wanted you to move. Yes, it was. Thank you very much. Oh, hey. That was a close one. Yes, I did. Let's see. All right, thank you very much. <laughs> wow, what a rock. Does it now? So, do we just stand here then? Oh, there's a little mouse in there. Can we get it off the table somehow? I don't know. The heck is that thing? Something sleeping. Can we just bypass it? What is with this ghost? I don't know if we should force it. That might be the wrong thing to do. There were some other ways I could have gone, so I'm gonna take a look back there and then... I might just cut back here if I don't find anything. Alright, so I should turn to the main room to have a look around. Let's see what's up north from us. It says take one, take a piece of candy. Sure. Proceed to open the menu. Um, how do I get to the info down there? Info. <laughs> Non-licorice, good, because I don't really like licorice. It's interesting, though. Almost looks like there's licorice down there around it. So that was just an item that we could have picked up, but nothing really special. 
Now they just picked up that one item, and I guess we'll try to get past this guy. We did just save, so I suppose it doesn't make too much of a difference. Because if it does go wrong, we can just reload. I guess we'll try to move him with force. Naps the block? Naps the bluke? Okay. Let's see what it says about him. Doesn't seem to have a sense of humor. Oh, he thinks he's real funny though. Oh, he's crying. Oh no. Whoa. Wishes he wasn't here. Hmm. Maybe you could try to cheer him up. Heh. <laughs> oh, okay. That's fine with me. Looks a bit better. What does it say? Yeah, I did realize that now if they're uh, yellow, that'll let you spare them. Looks a little bit better. Yeah, okay. Um, I guess just continue doing what we're doing. Does he like our joke? I don't know, he's crying. He didn't like it. Maybe. Let's improve to his mood again. Maybe do it one more time. Alright, go for it. Oh, he's crying the other way. Dapper Bluke. Oh, very nice. It's a very classy hat. Yes, it looks fantastic. How do we respond to him? Should we flirt with him or just cheer him on? I guess we'll just keep on cheering him. Oh. I guess it worked. You usually come to the rooms because there's nobody around. Ah, you met us, and aren't you lucky? Alright, so we made a friend. Fantastic, we go up a regal to the right. We got more frogs this way. So the right, what do we have? A dead end, but maybe there's a secret? Spider bake sale, all proceeds go to the real spiders. Oh wow, we can leave money. Space, one out of eight. What does that mean? Oh, they gave me a donut. That's so kind of them. Unfortunately, I don't have any more space, but I mean, I have more space, but I don't have any more money to afford all that anyway. Yes, I did catch the spider bake sale. I like that it tells you what was uh, at the other direction if you missed it. Oh, how, how dare they skip through your words so quickly. That's not very nice, but I have learned how to uh, skip through the words by now, anyway. Oh, we can go to full screen mode. Well, I'm probably not going to do that right now because it might mess up the recording. Four frogs, yes, that's probably what it stands for. You're probably onto something there. This is troubling, we need to get more frogs in here. Why are all the frogs so sad looking? Yeah, we, we spare pretty much everything we come across because I think that'll help us get, um, the ending that we want. Yes, the yellow means we can spare them, and I noticed that some of them, they are already yellow to start out with during the battles, so we don't have to do anything. That's very helpful, thank you. Maybe one day we'll have to do it, even if their name isn't yellow. Huh. Well, that's something I'll probably have to keep in mind then. Yeah, let's see. I guess I could just spare them right off. I don't know if it only works on one or both of them. Let's see. It only worked on the one. Um. What's he do? He just dances. Okay. That's cool. Uh, I guess I'll just talk to him for a little bit. Hey, what's up? I'm kind of nervous that he's going to jump or something, but I guess you don't have to worry at all. And that's all I had to do. Hey, what's up, Toriel? Oh, your house is a bit of a mess then. Well, I don't really mind. You don't have to do it on my behalf. Alright, so... 
Well, I guess if it's consumable, we can just use it up if we have no room left. Just one switch. Alright. It's rather cryptic. I guess we probably have to drop down to get to it, and we have to pick the right one. Wow, what is this thing? Well, I have to talk to it first. Um, devour it? I don't know if we should do that. Looks really creepy. Not mired by the USDA. <laughs> Farmed locally, very locally. Oh no. Oh no. Uh, there we go, we somehow avoided everything. That's quite alright. I don't think we need to, uh, have a meal just yet. No. Get away from me. He's here for my health. Can we spare him yet? No, we can't. I don't know if dinner means we're gonna eat him for dinner, or what? Alright, I guess we have to do- oh no. Um, what does dinner do? I don't even know. Oh, he's, he's just gonna attack us. Oh, green gives us health. Okay, that's awesome. Oh, he's, he's yellow. Alright, there we go. Nice. So, just pick one randomly. They're probably gonna be... Alright, so it's up there. And the other guy's there. I wonder if he'll do something if we talk to him. Oh, that's one of those things. Alright, well, we know what to do now. There we go. Whoa, went too far. Yeah, we're good now. I guess we'll talk to the other guy first, although it might just be another fight with him. What's up? Oh no, you can't get up. Yeah, ghosts should be able to fly, I think. I think you should be safe. <laughs> Alright, now this must be the right one. So, there's another one of those things down there. And I don't know what's in the bottom one, but... We're probably good if we just move on. What are these things? It's a switch. Um, not yet. Let's see what it says. The far door is not an exit, it simply marks a rotation in perspective. What? <laughs> it's a very odd thing. Nothing happened. So, if I go down there... Yeah, it's just a rotation in perspective, okay. If I can read this, press the blue switch. Uh, where was the blue switch? It was, like, back here. There we go. Luke's. Oh no. I don't pick on them. Uh-oh. Oh! He's steering right through us. So you can spare that one now. Yeah, I guess we'll do the sparing first so there's less difficulty. Oh! They come from the sides, I have to be careful. Wow. Still can't spare him. Don't pick on him. Oh, I think I messed it up. Uh, oh well. Oh, wow. Um... I don't know if I should use an item or not. I guess we will. Because I don't think I've saved in a while. There we go. Monster candy. Oh no, now it's gonna attack us again. Whoa, that was close. Alright, I think we're good now. Just to survive this last onslaught. Yeah, I probably didn't need to use that candy, but whatever. Ten gold for that. Now what? Well, that's easy enough. Red switch is right here. Okay then. 
And we probably have to do this one. Although, let me just double check. There we go. And another fight. Oh, uh, well. Really, you just have to talk to him. Whoa. There it is. Whoa. Yes, I know he is. Yep, do your little dance and then you can get on your way. Alright, cool. What do we got up here? A darkened tree. Oh, did you finish cleaning up yet? No, not really. We just kind of strolled around through the underground and overall I'd say we had a fun time. Don't worry, we're fine. Come on. Alright. I'll be right behind you. What's this thing? They fall right off. Oh, that's a sad tree. Ooh, we have a save point right here. Seeing such a cute tiny house in the rinse gives you determination. Save our game. I think that's enough for the first part. Cute little game. I'm um, definitely enjoying it so far. I like the music and it's kind of got a neat little vibe to it. Thank you for watching the first part of Undertale with me. I hope you'll join us for the next one. Until then, take care everyone.